The Loran system used a network of transmitting stations to cover large areas of oceans critical to combat operations. These stations worked in pairs. Each station sent out pulses of radio energy, which traveled in all directions at the speed of light. A ship or plane received the signal from the closer station first by a small fraction of a second. The time differences between pairs of stations were mapped onto a chart in hyperbolic, or curved, lines of position. Planes and ships carried specially trained operators who could read an oscilloscope and Loran chart to find their position. Determining position required at least two readings. The oscilloscope would measure the time difference between one pair of pulses, which the navigator used to determine a line of position on the chart. The navigator took a second reading using a second pair of stations, then found the intersection of the two lines to fix the plane's position. <laughs> 